Hey everyone, it is Nicole and welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today I am doing my monthly highlights for the month of October. I think my last one of these monthly highlights was in the month of July, June or July. It was one of them hot months, summer months. But the kit that I am using is from Grand Plans and I don't think it has a title or a kit name. But I will have a link in the description box if you guys want to purchase it. I hope you guys had a good October. My October was filled with a lot of different like fall activities. I've talked about this in my Play With Me's in the week that I do not like Halloween, but I really like the fall activities. Pumpkin carving, pumpkin picking, apple picking. That is my forte. So starting off, I'm just bringing in this washi to fill up the Thursday and Friday since there was nothing on those days because the first of the month was on a Saturday. So on to the first, I brought in this Oh Hello October sticker that I hand lettered in Procreate. I kind of got the inspiration from Letters to Letters to Apollo. On the second, I brought in this airplane sticker because my boyfriend was flying back home from his trip to Jamaica. And we do not live in New York. We live about 45 minutes to an hour away from New York, and we have an airport that is by our house. And both times flying to Jamaica and flying back in home, he decided that he was going to fly into JFK. And I had to fight traffic, and if I could, I would strangle him both times, but you gotta love him. On the third, I went to Shay Shack with my co-worker because sadly she is leaving the job. So we went and got food because what better way to discuss the next adventures of your life over food. On the fourth, I went and got more food with my mom. We got this um, new hot pot restaurant where I live. So my mom came down on like a really random day. And we went and got hot pot while my daughter was in school. And then after that, we had went to Barnes and Noble to get some books. Some uh, to get some book. I don't know my tongue. I don't know to get some books for my daughter. On the fifth, I had a day off, so I decided to drive to New York. And I usually don't drive to New York. I either take the train because I have the worst road rage. And if you have ever drove in New York, it gives me straight anxiety. So I try not to do that. And when I got there, me and my daughter went and got bagels. <clears throat> on the 6th I was super tired and super sleepy because I like I said I don't drive in New York and my mom drives but and my mom has a car but I just got stuck driving the whole day before so I was like extremely um tired so I brought in the sticker from uh Zaka Digital I think that's what it's called um, also, I had an eye appointment as well, so I brought in, I haven't been able to see my eye doctor in nearly a year and a half, and I feel like my eyes have just getting worse and worse, so I was so lucky to get an appointment. So I brought the sticker in from Paper Shire Stationery. On the 7th, I continued to watch The Orange is New Black. I am currently trying to get through all the seasons. I think I talked about this as well in a couple videos, that I stopped watching The Orange is New Black right after Fuse, um left the show and I never went back so I'm trying to get you know try to go through it you know when I have a favorite character even with Grey's Anatomy like after Mark Sloan and Lexi died it took me forever to finish it and then when Derek died oh I was done I was done I just like I couldn't and it took me a long time it took me about like four seasons after he had died and left the show to went, go back and watch the show again. On the 10th, I published my first play with me since I didn't post anything for the month of September. And then I wanted to start reading something new, but I ended up not finding anything that I want to read. So if you guys have any book suggestions that are really good, leave them down below because the last couple of books I have read have been straight mediocre at best. And not I me, mean, I don't want to say mediocre. But they haven't been, like, they they start off really great, and then in the middle, it kind of, like, drags out, and it's, like, at the end, like, okay, i seen this coming. So, let me know what you guys' favorite books are in the comment section. <clears throat> On the 11th, I FaceTimed with my boyfriend, which is also, you know, it's always a great joy of my eye, like, when he, when he doesn't make me want to strangle him. And then, me and my, um, 
best friend went into the gym, which is really great. I haven't really been in the gym, um, because I don't like going by myself. Like, I think I have, like, gym anxiety or a phobia, but I need to get over it and just continue to go to the gym because when he is working, I want to go, but I don't want to go because I don't want to go by myself. On the 13th, I drove back to New York once again, and this time we went to Costco's because they opened up a new Costco's by my mom, and she was raving about how big it is, and it was literally a waste of my time because it was the same size as the Costco's by me. Like, where my mom lived, they just opened up a new TJ Maxx, and that TJ Maxx is chef kiss, like, the greatest TJ Maxx I have ever seen, like, better than any of them by me. On the 14th, I got some Panera for lunch with one of my work wives, like one of my work wives, with my work wife, I only have one, and I started to draw again and procreate, and I made the cutest little Christmas stickers, and I can't wait to use them, I am itching to use them, I can't wait, I absolutely can't wait, I, when I was using my uh, paper planner, I would draw all the time my own like Christmas countdown stickers, and I did those, and I can't wait to use them this year. On the 16th, it was, you know, Football Sunday, so I brought in the sticker. And also, it was um, a cardio day at home. I was going to go into the gym, but I decided that by the time I had got up and started my daily routine, it was already, like, midday, and it was already football, and I was like, I'm not missing. I, I, I can't, I cannot, like... I, even if my team is not playing, I will sit there and watch all the games until like the nighttime game. And then by that time, I'm like, all right, I got to go to bed because I'm old and I want to go to sleep. On the 18th, I literally just did a whole bunch of planner catch-ups. So I just literally did nothing besides, well, I went to work and all that for like fun stuff, the the responsibilities. But other than that, I just did that. On the 19th, I watched my favorite Harry Potter, Chamber of Secrets. I know a lot of people like don't like that one, but I absolutely love watching that one. It just, they were so young, and they were so innocent, and it was just nice. On the 20th, me and my daughter made some homemade burgers and fries, and it was so good. My daughter's not a big hamburger person, but that day before she went to school, she's like, Mommy, can we have hamburgers? So we made bacon cheeseburgers, and it was so, so delicious. On the 21st, I was very cranky, (laughs) so the highlight of my day was saying that I need coffee, and I did get coffee, and on the 22nd, I just did some more planner catch-ups, because I wanted to get all the way caught up with my monthly spreads for the month of September, and I did that. On the 25th, it was a rainy night, and I love I absolutely love it. I don't like rain when I have to go outside and I have to be productive. But if I'm already done being productive and I can stay home and lounge, I love it. And it can rain all night for all I care. On the 26th, I had dinner with my boyfriend. On the 27th, I worked on some more Christmas and holiday stickers. And I cannot wait to use I'm probably not going to use them in this planner I'm probably going to use them in like my bullet journal plan my bullet journal planner but we will see maybe I can incorporate them somehow some way in this planner on the 27th no I'm I'm, wait no on the 28th my daughter had a Halloween party at her new school and I didn't think we were going to go because my daughter is really like me like we agreed to go to things, and then she's like, no, I don't want to go, but we went, and it was a really, it was a, it was a fun time, so I'm, I'm happy that she went, because her old school never did things like that, they always did, like, fundraisers, but okay, you pay, like, five dollars, or you pay, like, a dollar to come in and dress up as your costume, but they never had, like, any activities like that, so I was happy about that. On the 30th, since the day before, I went and me and my boyfriend drove to New York for a last minute, like, show. Um, my my boyfriend makes, like, beads as a hobby, and they were doing, like, a music expo, so he wanted to go, so we went. And on the 31st, it was Halloween, so I wrote that as well. And this is how, 
my monthly highlights for the month of October came out. I hope you guys had a good October, a good month. I hope November brings you a whole bunch of joy. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.